Hi, this is Dash from Bloom For Your Planet, and I'm here today at my cousin's property, um, and we are gonna do our first cutout. We're pretty excited. So this is Cindy. Hello. Eric, say hi. Hi. <laughs> so we got the highs we're gonna set up right here. And this is our mystery box. We think it's an abandoned dishwasher, so we're gonna try to pry that open and cut the bees out from it and hive them up so that they can have beehives and honey. So let's do this. So what we're gonna put first is a bottom board and then we're gonna put the deep box on. This is a Langstroth hive and this is where the bees are gonna go in and out. So we're gonna set up a station right here with the board so we can just do all our cutouts right here and attach them to these empty frames. So the idea is to cut the brood out and rubber band them into these frames, you'll see. And so we wanna get bees, some honey and baby bees brood in here. And we wanna get the queen. That's the magic thing to this whole process because if we get the queen in here, then all the bees are gonna follow and go into this box. So that's the whole idea. So I'm so excited to see what we've got in this dishwasher thing. <laughs> okay, so I put, I put a fire starter in my smoker with burlap and an egg carton and dryer lint because you don't want to be without smoke when you really need smoke the most. <laughs> Trust me, don't ask me how I know that. All right, so I'm gonna put it in here and we got some shredded paper. You can also use leaves. I threw a few camels in there too. breaking into the smoker for the first time. Oh, I think I just buried it. I'll see. All right, keep bumping there. Okay. The reason for the smoker is that the bees will sense that there's a fire in their tree or near their tree and they will go in and they will drink and they'll start drinking the honey. So their attention will be on the hunt, drinking honey because they're going to have to leave so soon and they have to be sustained. So, um, so their attention is off you and on to drinking honey. So that's the reason for the smoke. How do they know that if they've never been in a forest fire? God just made it that way, honey. Okay. All right. Okay, we got some good smoke. Excellent. I think there's roots around the frame. Okay. So we're gonna we can I think wiggle. We're, gonna, we're just gonna have to try to stand it straight up, I think. Really? Okay. Yeah. All right. Ready? Yep. Let's do it again. Ready? Mm -hmm. It is the dishwasher. You got that out? Yeah, okay. I got it. Oh my gosh, cool. But it's all back in there. They were coming out. There's the main entrance. Wow, that is too cool. That's that part. Just lifting up? Yeah. Okay. One, two. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Okay. Get back under there. <laughs> Isn't that awesome? Oh. That is so amazing. Yes. Okay, that's where a hive is. Yeah. Excellent. Okay. It's not very big either, so that's good. Yeah. Right. I say one box for sure. So. I bet they didn't move in too long ago. I think we can pull this out of our way. Okay. Dump some of the sticks, right Dash, you think? Yeah. That way y'all can see the hive, and if I need to stand here and... Yeah, absolutely. I think that's the best thing to do. 
Wow. Perfect. Is that good or one more? Yeah. If, if it'll that? stay there. Yeah, that's Let's great. We can definitely get at it from there. Yeah, it's staying. All right. Here we go. Okay, I'm cutting it off at the back. Okay. I'm just cutting it all off. How about the side over here? Is, you want to cut that off too so you can just lift it out as one big chunk? Okay, okay that's just comb. I'm just going to... You don't want that. Looks like you filleted a fish. <laughs> okay, we're starting to get into some... It's harder, a lot harder to get than I thought it would be. I think it's coming out in pieces instead of... Oh, because of the grid? Mm -hmm. I wish we could get that whole well, we can pull the grid out. We can pull the whole thing out, Nash, if you want. Maybe if that we makes should. it easier. All right. Let me cut it. it off at this side, okay? Okay. Well, it's not attached to yeah, that side. Yeah, I think it's going to all come out with the grid. Okay. How can it not Let's be attached try it then. over there? That's what. So tell us what you're doing, honey. I'm just cutting. <laughs> the best I can out of this dishwasher grid. And what kind what of piece is that? So we've got some brood, some baby bees, and some empty comb. So yeah, and some pollen. Looks like 6.35 at rush hour, doesn't it? <laughs> whole bunch of bees. Wow. So how would you make this into two without two queens? Um, if I put in the other box, then they'll make their own queen. Okay. If I leave one box queenless. That's the idea anyway. Oh my gosh. This is drone brood. So these are male bees and they're pretty much a drain. See how they're puffed up? It's kind of a drain to the colony, mm -hmm. so we're not going to include those. Oh, bless their hearts. Yeah, drone brood over here too, so we're going to lay that right there. But the, they don't get included. Yeah. Mail gets left out of everything these days. <laughs> <laughs> Privilege. These seem like really calm bees. Okay, they so this, really these are some worker bees, some girl bees. So we're going to want to keep that. What's the rusty looking wet stuff there? What is right that? here? Yep, yep, what is that? That's, that's brood, that's baby okay, bees. Okay, that's baby bees. Uh-huh, okay. So let's take that up. It's kind of like a puzzle. <laughs> Puzzle, so right? are you trying to fit it back together the way it was in there? I'm trying to keep it up and down the way it was like the okay. up part up. Other than that it doesn't matter. Other than that no I'm just trying to make it fit. Okay. And then we're gonna try to, there we go. I can probably see if Gloves. Yeah, no, it's not. You, you, my gloves might fit a little tighter on my hands if you want me to try. Oh, that might be a good idea. Right? A what? Okay, so we got that one. Idea. And they will chew these rubber bands up and bring, and pull them out of the hive. Amazing. Oh, really? Yeah. Wow. So we don't have to worry about removing them. Okay. Yep. Yes. <laughs> I keep lifting the camera up so I can see better. <laughs> <laughs> You learned that in videography. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of good pictures at the back of your head, honey. <laughs> oh, great. Nice. Put it in there. There's our first comb. <laughs> our first frame, anyway. Woo! There's one. 
Okay, you want to cut off one, Cindy, while I take this one up? Okay, just do your best. Nobody's an expert here. All right. Yep. That piece would almost fit in one frame. You're doing excellent. We're gonna be a sweaty mess after this. I agree. Sticky sweaty mess. Awesome, that is wonderful. That's you did awesome. great. Yeah, that's great. All right, I think it almost fit in one frame. Yeah. That's great, Sandy. Eric, you wanna cut one off while we're up here? Yeah, did she just come up along the side there? And yep, just like you were saying, just like slicing off the bone, just cutting it off. That's incredible how they build their oh, own yeah. little oh, sections like that, it isn't it? It smells so good. It's crazy. Got another fillet. Yeah, I don't know if that's the bees we're looking for or not. <laughs> hey Dash, what do you think about this one Eric's got? Does that go in another piece? Awesome, it's perfect. You Plant, you put there? it in that frame, yeah. So I think it's weird that after all this, they know which way's up and down. Which way's the top or the bottom. They're insects with right instinct. The yeah. What is, is that pollen? Yeah, there is some pollen So should there. I cut yeah. the, that piece yeah, off? Yeah, cut that okay. off. We're gonna lose them. If uh, you want to, you could break this off. I don't, okay. Take that off and see if it'll go. And try to keep it where it was, yeah, like that up was and down. down. Okay, awesome. Ooh, so that, just that cut. It doesn't look like there's much in there, so you can just cut that off and try to fit it. Perfect. I think this is going to do it. Oh wow. Second one. That. Okay, our third frame. Cool. Got some baby bees in there. Well, no queen, no okay. crown, no side wave. No queen yet. Mm. <laughs> we'll know. It'll be the one going, hello, hello. I wish it was that obvious. Let's just leave it here so in the leave, shade, leave, yeah, okay. for now. But I can move it out of your way? Yeah. And then we'll carry it up. Okay, good. All right, now we get in the, in the mother of the high. <laughs> so exciting. Oh, this is beautiful. Look at this. It just fell off, so oh, look at that. Wow. All right, baby bees. Hopefully they didn't get damaged. I'm gonna go put this in one. You guys can get one if you want. Cindy. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. Honey, you ought to be looking for the queen in these, right? Yes. I'm gonna okay. Keep my eye out. Everybody keep my eye out. The noise is just incredible, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Jeez. And the queen's in there somewhere. Mm hmm For sure. There's a piece going up and agitating. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what cycle. I was thinking. <laughs> mm -hmm. I can't get my hood in there. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
I got it. Okay. Uh, all right. Okay. Don't break, don't break, don't break. You got her or you need a hand? I think I got it. Ew, it's a hard angle though. It's on you wet. It's amazing they're going to the camera because it's black and stinging. Ooh. They're stinging the camera? Well, they're just landing on the camera. Okay. It's funny that they don't want the light. Okay, I got a little piece. I'm going to carry that up and you cutting. can continue. Sure. Okay. That is truly incredible. What is this, our fourth frame? It is. Cindy's gonna do it this time. Woohoo! You have to dust the bees out of the way? No, no, we want the bees in there. Gotcha. Uh, okay. All right, go back for more. Okay, what I can do is I'll cut out all the comb and then I take that bucket that's empty brush the bees into that bucket. We're going to carry them up to the hive and put them in. So that's what we're going to do after I get some more comb out. Okay. Entrance is mm -hmm. to the right. Yeah. I mean, no, uh, yeah. Bottom right. Look at all that honey dripping off of there. Oh, it's amazing. How can you say we're not gonna get honey out of here? Might get stoned. She's not gonna let us get honey. <laughs> What number is that? I don't know. This is five, maybe? I'll relight this. Okay. So is that five? Yes. Yes, number five. Number five. Cinco. Right. Cinco de Mayo. Yeah. Hippa, ah. hippa. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, it's just Cinco de Mayo. Oh, he thought we found the queen, didn't he? Yeah. yeah. Nope. She's in there deep. He, he was going to quit and start eating honey if we found the queen. He's ready. <laughs> Absolutely. Okay. That will be something to celebrate. All right. So, will will she be bigger? Yeah. She looks like a wasp almost. And look at this honey. I want them to have that for food. What about the people that cut them out? <laughs> no, we will not get this honey. We will get honey later. <laughs> <laughs> There's a jigsaw. Oh, I smashed a couple. Can I have their honey? All right. We're getting sticky. So if you get all the comb, like you seem to be getting, look at all the honey, look at the honey dripping off that. That is yeah, just. Right. That's what they're going to be eating. Let's try to put it down here. Put it on this one? I'm going to put it on this one. Look at all that honey dripping. That's good. Okay, we'll rubber band that I'm one. I'm gonna lick my glove. <laughs> I get a piece of honey that's busy. I'm not gonna like it though. <laughs> yeah, nobody wants a busy piece of honey. Nah, I must just make one. Okay, so this is the sixth one. Woohoo! Mm -hmm. 
because I want them to, to build straight. Which I'm hoping that will encourage them to not cross comb yet since we don't have any foundation. Now they're kind of sticking out a little, so it could influence. We'll have to check on, be sure to check on them okay. a lot in this next. Okay, so let's leave, here, let's leave room right there. And we're gonna shake the bees into here, so. Okay. How, about this, how about this one up here? I'm gonna leave that one out. That's okay. the last frame. And then we're gonna um, shake the bees into that space. All right, so let's go get the bee brush. How are we gonna shake them in there? You'll see. Okay. <laughs> where? Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake your beehive. So, I'm going to take this and I'm also going to take my paintbrush. <laughs> All right. You need, they're coming down at the bottom. You need a sure are. scoop or something. You need a bee back, huh? Okay. I found her. Really? Let's get a picture. That's great. Now I can get the drone. <laughs> That's close. That does look like You were hey, just trying to get attention. Edit that out, Hunter. Okay. See, she looks like well, a wasp. When we find her, but she's so much we'll just edit again. her into where you said, okay, hey, I found her. Oh, you almost need a scoop. Good grief. Yeah, you need a, uh, like a dustpan more than a broom. Yes, yeah, a dustpan is what we need. So, sweetie, look at the outside over here. There's a whole it's bunch amazing. on the outside. Are there? Okay. There yeah, are. there's tons of them out here if you want to try sweeping those in there. Okay. Okay. So how do you this. dump them in here? So you just start pouring? Yep. Wow. And how do they stay there? Look. Okay, can you brush them? Start brushing them off in there? Oh, I see. You're looking for the queen. Oh, there's a bone. Huh. Oh, wow. There's, there's, a bone. Lot, there's yeah. lots of bones out here. Yeah. Wow. We find them all the time. Man, if that's her leg, that's a huge queen. No queen? I don't see her. All right. More brushing. <laughs> Boy, we need a vacuum, don't we? <laughs> yeah, it's a bee bag. I'm telling you what. Getting tired. This thing probably is not going to stay here. To be honest with you. What? <laughs> Unless I need it. And we can try to get some from the outside too. We'll just try to get as many. Yeah, as look we at how many there are on the outside. Try to get as many as we can. Or Eric, if you'll take your hat off, we'll brush them off your head as they uh, yeah. gather. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I should say their son is an awesome firefighter. So. He's one of our heroes, modern day heroes. That's true. That's right. That's why shout we're out that. to Blake Court. Yeah, shout out to him, modern day hero. No chance they're underneath this sprayer here, right? There's a lot under there. Right? Well, just there's so much yeah, under there. I my hand around there. And okay, I just wonder. Yeah, there's a bunch of bees. Yeah, see how there's a big cluster underneath that? I just yeah, don't know. Hey, why don't we get some from the outside first and take them up okay. here? They're just flying, aren't they? Are any going in the bucket? Yeah, you have to shake it real hard. There you go. 
All right, here, you want to take it up, honey, or is that getting more? Yeah, he can get some. Yeah, look at them flying now. They're getting yeah. mad now. All right, let's take them up. <laughs> I don't care where the queen is, I'm not putting my butt in the air and fanning. Yeah. Oh, there's a huge piece. There's mm -hmm. a good one. That's about the biggest piece they're coming off, honey. Yeah, you wanna look at this one, Dash, and see what you see? I think we, I think we found her, guys. Really? There she is. Let's see her. Here she is, right there. Where'd it go, Eric? She's right there at the corner of my thing. See how she looks more, let me get her in the sun. Uh, and on top of the hive, just in case we lose her. Okay. Yes! Oh my gosh, Eric, we found her. Excellent. Woo! There she is. Victory! Where's she at again? Oh, She's I see her. Beautiful. Right, She's right, right there. Right there. Okay. Okay, see how she has that big hump on her oh, back? Yeah, okay. She looks like a wasp. A Man, lot different than the other bees. I'm that trying to get good, her in the sunlight. You guys get her right there. Thank goodness we got her. Good, Eric. So what do we do now? Just set that down in there? Or? Yep, she, that's going in there. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Good job, sweetie. Excellent, okay. Try them. Well now, let's smoke them. Now we know she's in there. Put this frame back and close it up and they will all come home. Okay? And what are you, how are you gonna get those bees out of the way? Yeah, I'm gonna go really slow and Cindy's gonna smoke them first. Smoke, Smoke them if you got them. And you can use the brush. Eric, you want to give her the brush? It's right there. The paint brush? Either one. The bee brush is better, I think. Okay. Okay, good. See? All right. Now, oh, wow. And this is That's, where the queen is, so I don't want to injure her. What's that? How they just... So I'm went. just going to go Oh yeah. Really oh, yeah, look. Slow. That's... Really neat. slow. Yeah, they did right here. They just kind of... Let it move out of the way. There we go. Woo. And that <laughs> is a successful cutout. That is Woo. awesome. Way to go, y'all. Okay, and then we need the inner cover. Can you get it? Yeah, I keep smoking them over here and then we'll lay the cover down. Okay, the inner cover. That's a beautiful thing. Yes. That is. That's awesome. Well, with predators, we do have to worry about that, so we might want to strap it down with some rope. Okay. Like through through the cinder blocks. blocks. Yep. And tie it down because we don't. Or want a bungee or a tie down. Well, here, let's bring this over here by the hive. Nice. Usually, it's a miracle you see them all march in. So let's watch for a miracle. And see these bees in the doorway, they'll stick their butts up in there and they'll fan her scent. 
telling these bees she's in here. Usually that will march right in, so we'll see. Give them a minute. I think go ahead and stop smoking them and um, let them get her scent. We can always go take a break and get some water and then come back and see if they're going to see and march in. It's feeding time. Yeah. Oh my gosh, they're so friendly. Hi girl. I don't have any either, sweetie, but you can check me out. Okay. Yeah, and they're not that big. I mean, I mean, will they grow a lot more? I don't really know how much they'll grow. What kind are they called? Cross between Longhorn Coriente. Okay. They're beautiful. Look at that one. Wow. Okay. This one? Yeah. She's your favorite, yeah. She's shy. Yeah, uh-oh, you could get really attached to these. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh dear. All right, we're gonna we're back. We're gonna check on them. We're hoping to find them in the hive, and I'll calm down. I still see a lot flying around, but let's go see. Oh, you can hear the buzzing and frogs. Oh look, the dish drainer is empty. That's great. Okay, so it's looking good. They've got their little butts in the air and they're fanning. So uh, that means that the queen is here and they're telling everybody, come on home. Let's do this. So it looks good. And the dish, the dish drainer is clear, but there is a pile of bees right here. A big group of bees. I think it's because we left some comb there and they're cleaning it up. So I think they'll clean it all up and then head back, head into the hive. Because we know we got the queen. If we if we didn't know we got the queen, then we'd be concerned about this. But since we know we got the queen in there, we'll just leave them to clean up. Okay. We're gonna slip a frame in there after we smoke them. Excellent! Woo! Awesome. Way Good to go, job. Eric. Way to go. <laughs> Good job. Good job. <laughs> all right. Me as I videotape my feet as we all do high five. Good, good. One more time for the camera.